Hello, and welcome to the video for the game option string has option node. This is our has option node. The option string is a string usually full of key value pairs. Sometimes you want to check and see if that key value is there, or the option in this case. And if it is, we're going to go ahead and do something based on that. So the node's pretty simple. It's the has option node. You can right click and type has option. You'll find it under the game options section. It takes in two things, an options string. Usually you can get the game mode and you get your option string from there. And then a key, which key you're checking for. And then it returns back true or false. So in this case, I'm gonna go ahead and play this example. I'm gonna print the option string, nothing, and check for has option. And we get false. Well, I don't have an option string. So we'll load up a wrap. Now we have an option string, key of blah, value of awesome, and we'll check. Do we have that option? We do. It's true now, because we do have blah. If I go ahead and hook this up, for example, this would be an e example of what you might use it for. Check to see if we have that option. And if true, we're going to go ahead and then parse the option and do something with it. One thing that's to note in regards to our option strings and checking is this is not case sensitive. So for example, I could do blah in all capital letters. We'll hit play, load the map, blah, has option, true. So my actual option that I'm setting is capital B, lowercase lax, lah, and I'm checking to see if all capital blah, and it's still working. Again, it's not case sensitive. And that's it, that is the has option node. It's useful as a sandy check to see if you have an option or a key before you actually check or process the value. So you make sure you get a valid result. 